Well, time for business news. The government has rolled out a digital upscaling program seeking to enhance the employability of micro, small and medium enterprises and the youth targeting to train over 50,000 entrepreneurs. The program by the Ministry of Industrialization, Stanby Kenya Foundation and Microsoft will see private sector players address a digital skills gap within the market through the rich digital learning and skilling initiative. In the advent of COVID-19, several institutions and organizations are changing their business models and turning to digital platforms to stay connected with their customers and other key stakeholders. This underscores the need for a tech-savvy workforce. It is in line with this that the government has taken to improving the digital skills of young people who lost their jobs during the COVID-19 pandemic in a bid to improve their chances of securing business opportunities. The program under the Trade Ministry in partnership with Stanby Kenya Foundation and Microsoft Kenya will see a total of 1,000 government employees upskilled and seconded to the program as instructors. A lot of our young people have demonstrated and have, that they are very tech savvy. So it also enables us to build on natural inclination of our young people and be able to show just uh, the, the amount of transformation the country uh, can, can gain. And today what you're seeing is two great private corporations partnering with government in building an aspiration and making the dreams of employment, entrepreneurship and young people growth a reality. The government believes technology will play a key role in transforming the economy and creating employment. Uh, enabling more people to develop you know, digital skills is part and parcel of creating uh, the entire you know, chain of, uh, of, of support and, and also because that's where the world is going. In a month's time, we will be speaking to different high school students to just encourage them to take digitization. So we encourage proactively the community, the young people, the older people, everyone, to look at digitization and up take, take up digital skills to just be ready for today and tomorrow. Experts project that the global labor market will need around 150 million new tech jobs over the next five years, with many other traditional jobs becoming tech-enabled. Betty Kiptum, Channel One Business.